The Field AI system came on our site approximately a year and a half ago. Our primary use for it was tracking of construction through photography. We used it from early on corn shell when there was really not a ton of building here and all the way up through a completed structure. Before Field AI was on our project, it would consist of a project engineer walking the site with a 360 camera and stopping at points and waiting and taking photos. Now that we have Field AI assisting us, it can be an automated process where I can have it go out in the afternoon and start to take pictures while I can work on other stuff. With the Field AI system, I can have somebody sitting at their desk, give it a route, it will go then walk the route while we're doing other things and really capture all that same data while that person that would have been walking is now able to join us in meetings or able to walk other parts of the project or really just be involved in the project other than walking around and taking photographs. If we're able to just program the system to go do what it needs to do while we do what we need to do, it's a huge benefit to us. Field AI has been transformative for my day-to-day -day work. I can spare two more hours in the day to focus on more creative aspects and problem solving rather than go out and take photos in the field. So now I just go into the dashboard that Field AI has set up for me and I click a button, set a mission for the robot and say, go capture this area. A construction project is inherently pretty dangerous. One thing that's there in an hour might not be there in the next hour and people are always constantly moving around. The system, as it walks around, is identifying hazards for itself. Many of those hazards could be a hazard for a human. So safety and field AI is something that is really exciting we see as a potential. For example, if the field AI system is walking around the site, it observes an edge of slab that doesn't have a handrail, a handrail got broken. Can it send out a message to the team identifying a safety hazard? Can it recognize a hole in the ground or a trip hazard? So another thought that we had is, can the system be here in the day performing its day-to-day -day tasks of photo documentation? At night, it goes and charges. Can it continue to walk the job site and perform security tasks for us? We see the system as very potential to do a ton of things that one, we can't do, or would just take a tremendous amount of manpower for us to do. Over the time that I've worked with Field AI, I've seen more efficiency in the way the robot navigates around site. But now that it knows the complete environment, it's able to make shorter routes to the next step and hence reduce the time it takes to cover a certain space. Someone told me it's about 15 to 20% of all the hours spent on a typical job is just people moving stuff. And I saw the technology and I said, look, why couldn't we add you know, motors to these carts and put a field AI brain on it? And then all of a sudden, as a foreman or a superintendent, I can say, hey, I'm getting ready for work on level two. Can you, you know, move five scissor lifts and all my gear up a floor? And it happens overnight. The Field AI software model can actually be taken from that one robot I'm using at this project. And it can be multiplied to any moving equipment. It could be a scissor lift, it could be a forklift. It could be really anything that can help in even general maintenance, even during building operations. And that would really save time. You could also remotely operate this robot to go to a specific part in your project and show you what's happening there. My hopes are, and what I think that the Field AI system can do in the future is really make us better. Not replace us, but make us better at what we do. Giving us more efficiency in what we do, helping us be better at documenting items, taking some of the more mundane tasks that we have to do and letting us focus on some of the more detailed, more critical tasks that sometimes we get pulled away from just to walk and take a look at something. So I really think the field AI system, particularly as it grows, really just make us a higher quality builder, a safer builder, and just generally a better builder while taking some of the things off our plate that frankly, we don't always have time for. I think that the future potential of the field AI system is really exponential. I think there's a huge amount of potential growth with it, a huge amount of help that it can give us. I think that it can make our lives better, our lives easier, our lives safer. It seems there's a ton of things that this system can expand to do, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what that growth is.